another box. Another box. So as you're watching from afar, um, we have a second box delivered from Weha. Weha. Yeah, Weha Which Tools. Very exciting. And we're going to open this one on camera. Again, just like to reiterate at the start of the video, <laughs> we paid, we paid for, this. for this. Yeah, yeah this is not, I'd love it to a bit. I'd love to stand here saying it's a free gift from yep, Weha. We no. can't believe our oh, look, we've got some free fantastic tools. No. It's a couple of years in the making at least, yep. and it's taken us six months to get it. Come on, yep. let's get it open with a wee hard knife. I don't think, unless you're a college lecturer, I don't think you understand how exciting it is to get a massive delivery of tools like this when you've you've had to really, you know, uh, like struggle on camera with the rubbish we got. Convince people of what you need. <laughs> milking it, it's milking so it. That's nice. There we go. So we think, oh, well, not 100% certain what's in here, we think we might have a couple of three torque screwdrivers. We've got two at the minute that have taken a massive hammer in. Mm, yes, wow, are. that's a, uh, that, no, 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 no. That looks a better box to have a little look at. I know the two, look so at that. Ooh, 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 we're told look up. Look at that. Okay, so we're gonna bring the camera in we'll and we're gonna delve into this box yep. and see what we've paid for yep. from Weha. Broken knives. Doing that knife. <laughs> well, the box is open then, Joe. Did we get any knives? We got one or two knives, yeah. We got a couple. Look at this, this is lovely. So uh, it's really nice, because obviously we love the Weha uh, cable messer, I think is the... Okay, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it rolls off the tongue. That's the one we yep. always use in the workshop. The cable messer. So um, yeah, we love these knives, because they're obviously uh, 1,000 volts rated. They are incredibly hard to get the cap off when we first get them, so just give me a minute. There we go. Ooh, <laughs> Just about got that off. Stab yourself in your hand with the, the knife as yep. you pull it off. So there we go. So we've uh, we've got our Weha stripping knife there, which is absolutely uh, a beautiful, beautiful knife. Nice and sharp. That cuts through uh, the cable insulation and the cable sheath, no problem. And of course, it also has that lovely uh, safety cap on there to keep it uh, safe and sharp as well while it's in the box. So we've got several of those. So all our learners can now have a lovely, lovely Weha knife. It's the Which one thing great. they all go for. Decent posi drive, screwdriver, and a decent knife. Yep. So if we've got them in every box, yep. that will be fantastic. And it looks like we've yep. got enough. Nothing worse than a bad or a blunt knife when you're trying to strip cable. If you wonder why we're not 100% certain what's in the box, it was ordered by our technician. So, oh, that's <laughs> not what I was expecting. Hello. That's a nice reveal. Oh, look at that. Okay, so, so we've been properly spoiled there. And I was expecting just the torque screwdriver, and I think it's... This number two, is it for the plus minus head? It is. In order that we can get to our terminations inside the circuit breakers, but we've actually got the full kit there from Weha, so that is fantastic. We've got, we got more than one of them as we've well. We've got three of those, and again- Three exactly the same. How many How many do we currently have in, in use in the workshop, guys? Two. Two, so we've gone from two to five. These are not cheap bits of kit in any way. So to have five of these now, it means that we've not got learners uh, waiting to get hold of one of these when they need to do stuff. We're not, we're not going to be asking around the workshop too much. Look at that. That's lovely. Yeah, it's proper lovely. A nice little pouch as well yeah, to keep everything together. So that's the full set there. Look at that. That is lovely. It's lovely, isn't it? And so we've got the plus minus there. And the, and the number one plus minus ah, there. So we've got both. We're going to show you in a different video. Yep. Uh, the number one and the number two plus minus head. So these fit perfectly into the earth and neutral bars. Mm -hmm. yep. And then you swap over. Generally, what electricians yep. tend to use is just the number two everywhere. Yep. We're finding these sitting beautifully. And we're going to show yep. that now in another presentation. And oh. it's lovely as well because we've got just a normal uh, screwdriver over there as well that you can change the head on and we've also got of course that all important uh, torque screwdriver which is which is the fantastic part so that's that's lovely isn't it that's going to properly make a difference in the workshop now yeah and uh, unlike sometimes you get a new kit when it's your own kit you put it away and don't use it this is going on the shelf yeah. this will be used the first day after yeah. uh, the Christmas break so yeah. that's fantastic really exciting. Okay. so we're presuming now we're going to have a, a repeat of last video where it's uh, uh, open up a box it's identical to the next box so <laughs> okay Lovely. Now I know I pointed this out in the last video that we did. Uh, these are obviously the thousand volt rated uh, screwdrivers, but what I absolutely love is the way that this tip tapers in here, how the insulation uh, tapers down so that here it's the same width as the screwdriver head. A lot of insulated screwdrivers, you have a, the plastic comes down thick all the way to there, and sometimes that can foul getting into the um, yeah. MCBs and terminals and stuff. You don't have that problem with when these. Plastic gets all scruffy and yeah, rough, and it yeah. looks terrible. It's, yeah, but it's, it's genuinely a fantastic, fantastic design. Such a simple tweak, but so so good for that. Absolutely lovely. Yeah, love Beautiful. that. Okay, so we've got some of those electrician screwdrivers. You call them medium flat tips. I think we've got some. Something different. Posies. Oh, wow. Again with the tapering tip. 
So that's Lovely. nice. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So posi drive screwdrivers yeah. as well. Again, nothing nicer. Uh, as, a, as an electrician, nothing nicer than a brand new posi, is there? Because that grips your screwdrivers like nobody's business. <laughs> oh, that takes me back. Yeah, yeah, you've got lovely, a brand new one in you and yep. you think, I'm not going to yep. slip. It's That's not going to slip. <laughs> oh, yes. And you can, you, can, you can put your wood screw on the end of that cut. You can hold the screw and the screwdriver won't fall off it because it's so... <laughs> yeah, dance it around when it balances yeah, it on the top. Lovely. Oh, brilliant. Absolutely love okay. it. I, I don't know whether we've got anything else, so it um, might be a case of us just flipping through now. So there's some more, more posi number twos. I think we might be, we might be at there, the, the limit of the new stuff. So, yep, the more electrician screwdrivers. So that's where we are. Happy so days. we've got, coming to the college now, over a period of a couple of sessions, we've got Weha kit that comprises of side cutters and pliers. We've got the knife. We've got the terminal screwdriver. Um, is Posies, that it? Posies? You've got Posies? Electrician yeah. screwdriver. You've got Posies down there? You've electrician got screwdriver. There. Yeah. So there we go. So we're that's looking brilliant. to increase the type of tools that we're using um, mm. in the workshop and the quality of those tools. Yeah, that's, that's the key point for me. We've not just got tools for the workshop, we've got quality tools for the workshop. And, you know, uh, <laughs> good tools will make a good electrician a better electrician, I think it's fair to say. Yeah, yeah. fantastic. So um, even though we paid for them, um, obviously we're chuffed to bits that we got yep. these. Remember, as I said before, if you're looking for a fire and you want to sponsor me and Joe with a set of tools that would be on shot on camera every time we do a video, uh, whether it be doing you know, testing, whether it be doing an installation one, we'd be happy to contact us. We'd be happy to have a chat. At the moment, we're using the Weha kit that we've paid for, and that's for our learners in the workshop. Well, Joe, that was an exciting way of starting yeah, the morning really from cool. an electrician's yeah. point of view. Yep. So, so it's all arrived. So, yes. Yep. So what we're going to do with this is what what we mostly do with new tools is put them in a cupboard, shall we? Lock that cupboard and, and then never use them. No, there's been a tendency sometimes to take that attitude. Oh, new kit. We'll have to keep that good, you know. But the new kit is it's for the learners, isn't it? Yeah. We want the learners to have the best experience they can when they come here. And part of it is you know not scrabbling around with kit, which is making what's already quite a challenging job yeah. even harder. You know. So new kit uh, is going to really really and help that out. Yeah. Good quality kit's going to help that. Okay, so we are kits here. Hopefully you'll see it in the videos as we go around with the students. They'll be using this kit. We'll be using it as well. So, it's time to end it, Joe. Should we do it? Yeah. We, we hope, hope this, this video, video has, has been, been some help. help.